Hello again, everyone. I'm Rich DeMarco with our three Army Athletes of the Week. Kip Weber from the Army Gymnastics Team, Carolyn Pittman from the Black Knights Women's Tennis Team, and Kaysen Best from the Army Men's Tennis Squad. Let's start with Weber, who was terrific at the ECAC Championships this past weekend in Springfield, Massachusetts. Weber tied for the gold medal on the all-around and cop bronze medal on both the floor exercise and the still rings. Finally all came together. I uh, kind of started off the year not as good as I would have wanted, but I definitely kept improving throughout the season and felt like I was definitely peaking right around um, right around now and hopefully keep continuing to peak towards NCAAs in a couple weeks. Yeah, it was a it was a great um, great competition. Basically I was really just going in trying to do my best on each event for the team and it just so happened that I kind of put everything together and and it was just kind of an added bonus at the end of the competition to find out that the I was all around champion of the Eastern Conference. It also was a great weekend for the Army men's and women's tennis teams as both squads won the star over Navy on Sunday right here at West Point. Carolyn Pittman capped off a terrific week, a 2-0 singles mark and 1-1 in doubles and two victories coming over Navy, winning the first Army singles point as well as the first doubles point. I was up 2-1 and then I got really ticked off. I started making a lot of mistakes and some people saw me go crazy and start smacking the ground. Then I got my groove back after Martha told me just to slow everything down and then it was easy and smooth after that. And then doubles. Um, I guess me and Mac were just head to head with the Navy guys and then all of a sudden we just started making more and more shots and being more consistent I guess you could say and being aggressive. The experience is amazing. Um, I want to take it. I want to change it for the world. I loved playing against Navy and I loved beating them, especially since I was recruited there and since half my friends on the Navy team are on that team. I take pride in that and I also take pride in the fact that my team fought until the very end and, and that only we only lost one match against them out of nine matches. But the Army-Navy men's tennis match provided the most dramatic finish after the Black Knights got out to a 3-0 lead. Navy tied it at 3. It was then up to match point as Case and Best for Army went up against Navy freshman Austin Jones. And it was Best pulling out the match in three sets, giving Army the star over Navy. It was brutal. Uh, Navy played really well. Uh, the whole team came out, fired up, and I mean, the louder they were, the better I played. So I feel like I played well the entire time. Uh, second set, uh, my opponent, he came out fired up and uh, it was a close one. And then third set, just the Army team behind my back, it, it was amazing. Oh, it's awesome. I mean, they're obviously our arch rival and stuff, and you kind of think it's a little arbitrary until you, uh, until you get on the court and you realize actually how intense it is. So it felt great. So there you have it, our three Army Athletes of the Week, Kaysen Best and Carolyn Pittman from the Army men's and women's tennis squads as both Black Knights teams won the star over Navy and Kip Weber, who had a tremendous individual performance at the ECAC Championships over the weekend in Springfield, Massachusetts. For Night Vision, I'm Rich DeMarco.